had a little bit of a knot in my stomach for the last couple weeks waiting for this race. So trying to, you know, treat it like any other any other race, you know, trying not to uh, count points or, or do anything like that. But it's definitely a little bit easier chasing somebody, you know, uh, you know, a little less pressure. But I mean, this is, you know, definitely the spot to be out, out front. Uh, you know, it gives me a little bit of a cushion. I'll leave the bike prep to them and they can leave the ride to me and hopefully it all works out. From the very first race down at the stadium, uh, we ended up winning down there, but since then, I mean, the bike is a totally different bike. We've went through and redone valving, uh, uh, the springs on it, the motor, uh, the power commander, just the whole works. I mean, everything we can do just to fine tune this bike to make it run better. And, uh, you know, by now, uh, these bikes are going to be awesome for next year. We're just going to put them up on the shelf and uh, wait for next year to run them. There, there's usually never a time I want to go out there and just play around. I usually want to go out there and win. Uh, I got the five wins and Brad's got four and I'd really like to make it six wins, you know, instead of him tying me up. And, uh, but like you said, a lot of it's just a lot of fun. Uh, come out here to Arizona, uh, have some vacation time and everything. But it still comes down to business once we get out there on the track. You know, we just lost my one of my really good friends from Canada, and uh, I told my sponsors, I said, listen, I want to win this for Jesse. Let's do this right. Let's win it. Uh, we got here, qualified well, almost won the heat, uh, and then in the main, I thought I was screwed, but and then we came back, we fought tooth and nail for it, and you know, pulled it through, and that one's for Jesse. I I had his number on the back of my helmet the whole day. He was with me for the whole ride. Uh, that last straightaway, that bike's never ran that good before, so I figured Jesse was probably running behind me, pushing that thing. So, you know, I he was with me for the whole ride, and I, I could feel him there. Dude, I wanted to win this so bad. I came into this race, I was more focused than I've ever been. This one is for Jesse. Jesse, you freaking this, man. Jake, uh, what do you say? I mean, tell me, what's it feel like? It's unreal. I mean, uh, I don't know which to be happy for. Won the race was a big deal, and you know, won the championship. I don't think it's set in yet. 
You know, I, I probably should have played a little more conservative. We were kind of bumping and banging and bashing. Probably situations I shouldn't have put myself in, but you know, that was uh, that was pretty much the safest spot to be. You know, I didn't want to get shuffled back fourth, fifth, sixth, and you know, uh, I've kind of learned over the years on miles. Uh, I'm not much. It uh, doesn't work out for me if I lay back and play play the strategy. You know, I just if I'm not leading, try to get to the front. You know, I just took took the easy route and just uh, you know led it off a of turn four and you know made those guys try to pass me and. Uh, Jared, I think, came up probably about an inch short. It was uh, it was pretty close there at the line, and uh, you know I didn't know didn't know who had it until we came back around. But like I said, I mean it's uh, I don't think it's uh, sunk in yet. The the knot in my stomach's gone, but you know I don't think the uh, the whole deal is, is settled in yet. And I think they were just as nervous, or if not more nervous, than I was earlier. You know, it definitely wasn't uh, wasn't very reassuring when I look over at them and they're working on the bikes and they're you know doing the same thing over there but uh you know i knew they had it under control they had uh, had a good bike for me and kept it running good all day but you know uh dave zanotti his uh his father mario had a you know a team with steve eklund you know i think it was uh 1979 or 80 you know 30 something years ago uh steve won the championship with his dad so you know 30 31 years later for for him to do this me and him do the same it's cool pretty cool